Namaste friends, my name is Kai and I'm a yoga teacher. We would like to present you a yoga series that's called Yoga at Deep Communion. And the first episode of this yoga practices is Ashtanga Vinyasa Yoga for beginners, for very beginners actually. So the practice will go from 15 to 18 minutes maximum, finished with Shavasana. And this is a practice that everybody can practice without getting, being intimidated from the original practice itself. You can start with as little as 15 minutes. Uh, you can go up to 30 minutes if you feel stronger and so on. But I would highly recommend that you start this practice. And if you need to modify a postures according to the body, if at some point you feel that you cannot take some postures, you can sit down, take a breath, relax. So this is the practice that beginner student can take and you can go according to the strength at the moment. And if you feel tired or out of breath, just sit down, take a breath, relax and continue. It will give you tremendous peace of mind, relaxation to the body your meditation will go much easier and much deeper. Thank you so much. Keep practicing. Bring your hands together in front of the chest. Om. One day Gurunam Charanara Vinde Sandarshita Swatma Sukava Bodhe Nishriya Se Jangalika Yamane Samsara Hala Hala Moha Shanti Abhau Purushakaram Shankachakra Siddharinam Sahasra Shirasham Shvetam Pranamami Patanjalim Om Shanti 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 Surya Namaskare A. Come inhale, raise your arms, look up Exhale, fold forward, head down Inhale Half raise the spine, shoulders back. Exhale, step into plank, lie all the way down. Inhale, hands on the shoulders, open your chest, look to nose. If you feel strong, pick yourself up. Exhale, all the way back into down dog. Separate your feet, hip distance apart. Your hands completely open bend your knees if you have to look between the feet or to the navel and breathe there make sure that your spine is straight but your knees can stay bent stay breathing straight arms now inhale start walking forward feet together head up inhale half raise the spine exhale fold Inhale, come all the way up, look up. Exhale, hands down. Surya Namaskar, second time. Inhale, raise your arms, look up, stretch up. Exhale, bend your knees if you feel pain in your legs. Again, inhale, half raise the spine. Exhale, step back into plank. Come all the way down on your belly. Inhale, hands down under shoulders. Look to nose, open your chest, exhale, push yourself back into Adha Mukha Svanasana, downward facing dog. Your feet are separate, hip distance apart. Your hands are completely gri gripping the floor. Your fingers are open. You can come down if you're really tired into child's pose, Balasana, and stay breathing there. Now inhale, push yourself into down dog and start walking forward. Bring your hands, feet together. Inhale, half lift, exhale, fold. Inhale, come all the way up. Look up, stretch up, exhale. Hands by the side of the body. Feet together, inhale, raise your arms, look up. Exhale, belly in, fold forward. Inhale, half lift. 
Exhale, step back into plank and come all the way down. Hands on the shoulders. Inhale, open your chest. If you feel strong, lift yourself up, shoulders away. Exhale, push yourself into down dog. Separate your hands, shoulders width apart. Separate your feet, hip distance apart. Make sure that your knees are looking forward. Make sure that you're pushing yourself back towards the heels and breathe. Now, inhale, walk forward, bring your feet together, head up, exhale, fold forward, inhale, come all the way up, look up, exhale, hands down by the side of the body. Surya Namaskar B, squat low, inhale, raise your arms, look up, tailbone in, exhale, fold forward, head down, inhale, shoulders up, back, straight spine, exhale, step back and down through the plank. Now, inhale, shoulders back, open the chest, elbows to the ribs, exhale, push back, turn your left leg 45 degree, bring your right leg all the way forward between the hands, make sure that the front leg is 90 degree, back leg completely straight, inhale, raise your arms, look up. Exhale, hands down, push to plank and come all the way down. Again, inhale, open your chest, shoulders back. Exhale, push back into down dog. Now, right leg 45 degree, bring your left leg between the hands, square your hips. Now, 90 degree angle front leg, inhale, raise your arms. Exhale, hands down. Push into plank and come all the way down on your belly. Inhale, raise your chest, look to nose. If you're strong, pick yourself up, tighten the buttocks and push yourself into Adha Mukha Svanasana, down dog posture. Keep breathing there. You can always come down into Balasana, child's pose. Rest. Keep breathing. Don't hold your breath. Stay there and breathe. Now inhale, push yourself back again into down dog and start either walking or stepping forward, feet together. Inhale, half lift the spine. Exhale, fold. Again, Utkatasana, squat, tailbone in. Inhale, raise your arms, look up. And exhale, come all the way up. Samastiti here, bring your hands down. Feet together, standing straight. Squat low, tailbone in, inhale, knees together, raise arms. Exhale, fold forward, head down. Inhale, head up, shoulders back. Exhale, step back into plank. Bring your knees down, chest down. If you're tired, inhale, look to know, shoulders back. Now, if you're really strong, pick yourself up, arch the spine, exhale, push back. Now, right leg forward, left leg in 45 degree, remember, square the hips. Inhale, raise your arms, look up. Exhale, hands into, down, straight body and plank. Inhale, chest up, shoulders back. It, all the way up if you can. Exhale, push back into the down dog. Now, bring your left leg all the way forward between the hands. Inhale, raise your arms, look up. Warrior posture. Exhale, step into plank, come all the way down. Inhale, push the floor away, pick yourself up, arch buttocks squeeze, exhale, push yourself back into down dog and stay breathing there. Remember to push your body weight towards the heels. If you really come tired, you can come down always into balasana, baby's posture. Relax there and breathe. Now inhale, come all the way up. Push yourself back into down dog and start walking towards the front of the mat. Inhale, head up. Exhale, head down. 
Squat low, tailbone in, inhale, raise your arm. Keep inhaling here, elongate the breath. Exhale, hands down. Take a moment. Now separate your feet, hip distance apart. Bring your hands on your waist, inhale, arch. Exhale, fold forward, head down. Grab your big toes with the two hands, two fingers. Inhale, head up, exhale, suck the belly in, bring your belly on your thigh, head down, elbows to the side. Remember to keep your spine straight and breathe. Inhale, head up, half lift the spine. Now bring your hands under the feet halfway or full way up to the wrist. Again, inhale, half lift the spine. Exhale, suck your belly in. You can bend the knees. Bring your head down, elbows to the side and stay breathing. Remember deep resonant breath. Inhalation, exhalation, one length. Inhale, head up, half raise the spine. Exhale. Release the hands. Now inhale, open your chest, arch back. Exhale, feet together, hands down. Inhale, raise your arms, look up. Exhale, fold forward, stomach in, head down. Inhale from here, shoulders back. Exhale, step into plank, lie all the way down. Hands down, inhale. Look to the nose, open chest. Exhale into the down dog. Cross your legs and come into sitting. Now stretch your legs forward. Straighten your legs. Feet towards your face. Now take your feet by the side with the, both hands. Inhale, look up. Exhale, elongate forward. Elbows to the side, don't touch the ground, suck your belly in. Breathe there. Now bend your knees for a stiff people, inflexible people. Bring your stomach on your thighs, look on your toes and breathe. Again, straighten your legs, head down. Inhale, look up. Exhale, hands on your mat, cross your legs. Step back into the plank. Come all the way down on your belly. Inhale. Look up. Exhale. Push back into down dog. Again, cross your legs. Come into sitting. Straighten your legs. Bring your left leg down, touching the buttock. Right leg on top and over of the left leg. Left arm up. Place on your thigh, take your right hand up and over, close to the spinal cord, but don't touch the spinal cord. On exhalation, nicely twist, look over your right shoulder and breathe, be on your fingertips. Your spine is straight like an arrow. Inhale, open, change the side, right leg is touching the left buttock, left leg is over the right. Inhale, right arm up, exhale, inside the thigh. Inhale, stretch up, exhale, twist and look over your left shoulder. Make sure that the left chest, left shoulder is open and your right hand is touching index and the thumb. Inhale, uncross your legs. Again, step into plank and down. Again, inhale, open, look to nose, exhale, down dog. Again, cross your legs and sit down. Now we are going into Navasana. Knees together, chest up, spine straight. With both hands, you can Place your hands under the knees, open your chest, make sure that chest is up, you are looking towards your feet and breathe there, engage the belly, engage your core, cross your legs and take a pose. Again, inhale, 
chest up spine straight bring your feet forward but keep them bending look on your feet chest up engage the belly spine straight shoulders down make sure you are breathing cross your legs again inhale there exhale push back into down and lie down all the way inhale hands on the shoulders if you're feeling strong pick yourself up tighten the butt buttocks exhale push back into down dog again cross your legs and sit down all right from there lie down all the way onto your spine get ready for bridge posture separate your feet keep distance your feet your legs are 90 degree now you can bring your hands together interlace the fingers open your chest push your hips up either hands on the floor or again interlace the fingers and stretch your arms towards your heels arch nicely and breathe squeeze the buttocks slightly all right bring it down hug your knees for a moment now come into sitting again straight your legs forward grab your feet from the side inhale look up exhale belly in look down keep breathing now for if it's difficult bend your knees and keep breathing there in time you will reach down it's not a problem but keep breathing inhale look up exhale hands down cross your legs again now bring any leg which is more flexible on top on top of your thigh and stay breathing there if you're really comfortable go into full lotus full padmasana cross your legs nicely bring your hands on your knees or on your thighs shoulders down look at the tip of the nose now you can go into even easy cross posture easy cross sukhasana bring your thumb and index together of the both hands open your spine yes again recross your legs into full padmasana if you are really comfortable if it's accessible to you open your chest keep your spine straight shoulders down inhale all the way down as if you're inhaling from the mother earth all the way up to the spine to the crown of the head and exhale all the way down give down with all appreciation and gratitude to the mother earth be grateful for this breath be grateful for this body be grateful for this life open your legs and get ready for final lying posture which called shavasana inhale take your legs up and slowly on exhalation bring your legs down inhale upper body up hands like a scissor exhale lie all the way down now in this final posture you don't have to do anything simply relax and let go let go of that deep and resonant breath let go of that tension now all what you have to do is only focus on your feet you don't have to move your body anymore you don't have to move your body physically simply bring your attention on your toes and relax all your toes without moving them now relax top of your feet relax the arches of your feet relax your heels relax your ankles relax your shin bones and relax your calf muscles relax your knees undersides of the knees relax your thighs relax your hamstrings relax your 
hip joints. Allow your hip joints to open as the book. Relax your pelvic floor. Relax your buttocks. L relax your lower back. Relax your waist. Now relax your stomach. Relax your organs and feel the space between the organs. Relax your chest. Relax your rib cage. Relax the intercostal muscles. Relax your lungs, your heart, your clavicles. Relax your shoulders, your arms, and your hands. Now, bring your attention on your spine. Bring your attention entirely on your spinal cord. Relax your spinal cord completely. Relax every vertebrae and feel the space between the vertebrae. Relax the muscles of your back. Relax your shoulder blades. Relax your neck. Relax the seven cervicals of the neck. Relax the neck muscles. Now bring your attention on your throat. Relax your throat internally and externally. Relax your jaw, your, mus your mouth. Relax your tongue, your lips. Relax your cheeks. Relax your eyes. Relax your eyebrows. Relax your temples. Relax your forehead. Relax the back of your head. And the crown of your head. Now, keep your attention. Keep your focus completely on your breath. Allow the breath to be your guide. Stay there as long as you wish to. Keep focusing on your breath. If you wander some, some time with your thoughts, if you go somewhere very far, keep on coming back to your breath. You don't have to open your eyes. You don't have to move. Simply acknowledge that for this next couple of minutes you will stay with your breath and allow your body to sink into the ground to melt into the floor allow your body to be heavy allow your body to melt keep focusing on your breath keep relaxing You can rest there as long as you wish to. But remember, try not to go into the sleep. Try to keep your mind alert, yet relaxed. You are simply guided by your breath. Simply be with the breath. Namaste. Prajabhyaha paripalayantam Nyayena margena mahi mahishaha Go brahma memyaha shubhavastu nityam 
लोका समस्ता सुखिनो भवंतु ओम शांति शांति शांति